And we're back. We got we had to get we had to take a break and get our seconds. A and our more wine and food. <laughs> so um since Shalina has demonstrated she has lots of good advice, so me and Taylor want to ask her questions because it sounds like she has lots of good techniques and tips. And you mentioned a question earlier. Yeah, so what's your dating technique, Shalina? Do you prefer or do you normally meet people in person or do you go on apps like Instagram? I feel like you have to understand the world we're living in now. Mm -hmm. You can't expect people first off people don't know how to communicate so you can't expect even if you were outside somebody likes you to say something to you. They would literally go find you on Instagram or <laughs> try to find you really? somewhere else or ask about you. So I feel like you have to kind of go with the times. I prefer you be upfront and honest with whatever which way you choose. Say, you know, I'm interested in you. Let's, let's, you know, I want to get to know you. Mm -hmm. Just start with that. So I feel like whether it is on Instagram, dating apps, it's just those people are really are strangers. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. At least on Instagram, you had to, they had to have found you from somewhere. Mm -hmm. Or Facebook, they know you from somewhere. But this whole stranger danger thing, I mean, it's just people are creeps. You make a good point. It's just, and it's just, uh, and they know what to say to get your number. Yeah. But it's just like, and then, and then what? And then what I don't like, be cautious of like people who only want to keep it on social media. Like I'm grown, right? And I'm old fashioned. You know how many people, and this is for all women, if you're on social media at any point, people are trying to talk to you. They're trying to get to know you. They do the high, beautiful, and whatever. Mm -hmm. If that's where you want to keep our relationship, then that's not a relationship. Like, you should be a man and be like, hey, what's your number? Yeah. I want to call you sometime. Yeah. Like, stop all this texting or when you meet me, oh, do you got an Instagram? I do, but I'm not giving it to you. Like, you need to ask for somebody's number. Like, get back to that. That's weird. So, I think all of those things need to come back and disclaimer your communications major mm -hmm. master's degree and all she's on and fire. your expertise yeah <laughs> shirley ned how do you do you see like i know you obviously see a a change or a shift in communication through social media do you think it do you see it going back to people like having confidence after covid19 being from qu quarantine that's a good question going back to like talking to people in person or do you think it'll be the same I feel like, because I'm always trying to be an optimistic person, mm -hmm. hopefully what COVID-19 showed you is what's important to you, mm -hmm. what your priorities are, the type of person you want to be, who, what do you want to be known as and remembered as. Like, I hope, Hopefully, those are things you took into consideration. Um, people didn't know how to talk or communicate before COVID. True. Yeah, that's true. So, so what are we exactly going back to? True. True. And right now, we're so inundated with information and what we should like and all kind of stuff. And stuff not, nobody's really being accountable for anything. I feel like you have to want it. Like, there has to be, we understand the system is broken. Mm -hmm. How do we all want it? Like, enough people need to want it enough. I do feel like we're on the brink of things changing and people getting back to those picnics and guitars. <laughs> But it had, I mean, I don't know when, but hopefully, you know, because mm -hmm. all, all yeah. COVID did was just make it more fast paced in a sense of, oh, I don't have to talk to you or I got to talk to you. Like, it was yeah. like, yeah, people were doing things just to do things. Mm -hmm. It feels like a scary Good movie, point. like with COVID and stuff like that. Um, I'm shooting blanks right now. <laughs> but you have made super valid great points Jarlina. um the thing that's like with COVID I like because the way how I see it like because me and my boyfriend we were like so excited it's like yeah movie theaters are open and they were like ah they're old movies so when you mention about like like hopefully things will go back because like I'm all for like new things but there's some certain things when it comes to your like romantic relationship I'm all about old school about that <laughs> That I'm all about old school. And people don't know it. Or yeah. people, it's not advertised. We are in America where we want whatever's put in front of us. Mm -hmm. And that is basically not even really dating. 
You can yeah. just because you talk to me and you bought me something, that's not a date. Mm-hmm. Like even the people, that's why I said date as many as you want to. Some mm-hmm. of them go. Re- you know, people don't even read books. Like I read books. Like you have to find commonality. Read books. That's true. Like, <laughs> like, <laughs> like relationships and marriage is serious business. It's mm-hmm. not something that's a fad or whatever. It's but because. We are sitting here and everything's given to you. This is yeah. what you should like. It. Mm-hmm. They're not giving you backstories. They're not giving you context mm-hmm. yeah. of what it really takes for those relationships to work. Very true. So it's like, no. <laughs> like, no. <laughs> like, you have to be okay. Like, old fashioned. It's not, I only want to say old fashioned. It was done. Do you know, like, in the old, like, older times, like, first off, you couldn't even come and talk to me, right? You yeah. had to go through my parents and bring like oh. three goats. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, oh, can I even see your daughter? Yeah, I go through the yellow pages. But you, 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 yeah. you had to go. You know what I mean? Like, y'all don't even like show up to the door no more. Yeah. Why am I paying anything? Like, you know what I'm saying? You were supposed to have like four buffaloes. You know what I mean? Like, you you gave up something. Yeah. But I get it. It's because sacrifice and you know. Like, like basically what's going on, the girls are a certain way, the guys are a certain mm-hmm. way. Everything is really fast-paced. So hopefully, it goes back to that genuine and intimate connection, which is what I think COVID taught a lot of us. That's really what we need. We need those intimate and genuine and meaningful relationships. That's true. I agree with you. My dad likes goats. He even said he wants gifts. My oh. dad's old-fashioned. He's considered that. He wants a goat. Oh, really? <laughs> My dad wants a goat. <laughs> He wants at least three and, and five cows. Wow. My dad's old fashioned. Like, he don't, yeah. yeah. So I agree, Sharina. You have to give up something. Yeah. Five, a $5 box is not a sacrifice. No, it's not. When I'm telling you to cash at me, that's not really a sacrifice. Or a link your big account to mine? That's not a sacrifice. <laughs> I want some money. <laughs> or she's some Gucci. Or something to buy herself. Damn. Or she's candy. Because what you're asking, you're asking me to come. You're asking me to be territorial. Like, you, you don't want nobody else to talk to me. You need to show some sort of provision. Yeah. That's why I'm asking you for some money. What are you going to do? Yeah. I have everything I, I need, but you need to be doing extra. Yeah. You, your job is to keep my attention. Yeah. You're <laughs> wow. Everybody, everybody else and their mama. You should have a podcast and do videos like this. Bro, BDE. Yeah. yeah. I'm a BDE for Ambrose. <laughs> yeah, like Shalina. Yes, queen. We need to follow Shalina. Yeah, follow um, Shalina. Yes, She's the queen. Do. She has Dropping your gems. answers. Yeah, she has all the answers. And she's oh, great yeah. at communicating. Follow her. She- and giving information yeah. and explaining the information. Hell yeah. Follow Shalina. Follow Shalina. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. You're all so fired. Yeah, yeah, you're all fired. Is it all through experience? Or do you have to, like, read things to, like, know how to date? Like, how did you get to this point? Because you're, like, older than me. So how, like, what? Much. Not much. <laughs> but you're, like, my big sister. I, I, I see you as my big sister. So, like, Same how did you here. get to this, to this, like, point? Of, like, Live, like, that's what I'm saying. I can't talk to somebody younger than me because you haven't seen nothing. You that's haven't true. lost anything. And I don't know, like, my favorite quote, one of them is, it's better to have love and to have lost than to not love at all. And that is like, you have to be able to lose something. So when you know, what do you really want and what do you really need? Mm-hmm. And once you've experienced that, not once, probably twice, and once you like really navigated life and dated a whole bunch of people, you'll see what life is really, what, what is success to you, what matters yeah. to you. Mm-hmm. It's just life. Mm. I can't believe I forgot about this. Have you guys ever approached a guy like for their number or on a date? All the time. I have never had that. No. Yep. Go for what you want. Your job as a woman is to make it known. You have to remember, we all roll in packs. So if it's three of us and he like you, he don't know how to talk to you because it's three of y'all. Like, you know? So you have to do something so he knows. Oh, I get it. You need to be like, yeah. hi. I mean, I would say hi, but I'm not going to be like, can I have your number? I wouldn't Cause do my that. Because yeah. I want a man's lead. And if I'm no, but that's not, okay, stop. Is that not, is that, is that so that's not necessarily leading. That's making, letting them know what it is. 
But me looking at you is letting you know how it is. <laughs> I can have something on my face. You get what I'm saying? Huh? I can have something on my face. Like, I could be looking at you for multiple, a multitude of things. Right. We're women. They, they're not mind readers. Mm-hmm. <laughs> they're very one, two, three, four, five, six. That you got to give them every instruction in the book. True. The true leading comes in. I gave you what the instruction was. Mm-hmm. Let me see you follow through. That's the leader. Okay. 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 I, I can. But see if that. he does, if it's three of us and it's it's three dudes over here, somebody like you. Mm-hmm. Like we we looking at each other. <laughs> I looked at you like, what is this looking for? Like everybody looking. Okay, everybody like, looking. Somebody needs to say something. You gotta say make something. Plan, make you gotta over walk over there and be like, "Hi, <laughs> yeah." <laughs> you need to do this. Hi, hi. <laughs> you can, you gotta do something for her to be like, "Oh, okay, now I can." <laughs> I'm gonna call this Shalina. Yeah. <laughs> hi. Well, we should totally do that for like the outro. Bye. Yeah. Bye. <laughs> call this Shalina. Shalina, Amber Ocean. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so that's you just they don't know like you have to understand True. guys what they're seeing and what's being fed to them they gotta have a thousand dollars to sell to spend on you for dinner they gotta have a Lambo they gotta do all of this stuff for you mm-hmm. I don't have that but I think you're cute I wonder if she gonna really like me you have a good point you do you I wanna know like do you know like come on we gotta help them out they, they're diff, they're diff, living in a different Realm. We're mm-hmm. supposed to be looking pretty. Hey. <laughs> hey. <Hi. laughs> but they have they have to figure that out. You're right. That's true. You make a good point. So you need to tell them right. something. I'll probably Even if this. you don't give them their number, but just be like, I like to drink wine and strawberry. Would you like to take me to the bar and get another one? Ooh. <laughs> something like that. You got to tell them something. You make a good point. Or like a favorite coffee. Yeah. You know, right. Like wherever you at, like, would you like to accompany me over there to go get it? And yeah. that's up to you. You got that three minutes. Shirlina, where were you? For real. <laughs> You're like a big sister. I'm telling you, you big sister, Shirlina. Yeah. Like, period. I'm the only girl, so I don't have a sister. Hmm. I claim you a sister. Tell my sister to appreciate my services. <laughs> <laughs> period. Hey. hey, I'm gonna use that. Yeah. But you gotta you, they, imagine, no girl. That's not that's not what's seen. That's true. That's we're all rough. We that. ragged. We all talking about do this, do this, that's do this. Good. And we're here. And none of them yeah. went. None, none of us went like this. Hey, <laughs> you know said, hey. I'm I'm, screaming. You got to tilt your head. Hey. <laughs> and if he, I mean, what other look? <laughs> like that show, that's telling you everything right there. Yeah. Something I just, I, was, I just be staring. <laughs> I don't do this. Like what is that? Why are you, you staring? Right. You, you look it. aggressive. <laughs> <laughs> like what is that? Can you wink at the guy to let them know? You could have dirt in your eye. You need to do something <laughs> else. Like why? <laughs> what is? Hey, <laughs> your job is to say I'm here. I'm available. Oh You're right. You make a good point. You make a good point. Like, what is going on? They don't know. You make a good point. Okay, I have a question for you. Me? Yes, you. <laughs> hey, Taylor. Hey, Taylor. Screaming. <laughs> so, um, the guys you have dated, have they always approached you? Yeah. Yeah. But you well, have- actually, only one guy approached me, like, in person. The other ones were, like, on social media or through a friend. Okay. But only like one guy. They still approach you. Oh, they still approach me, but I don't know. I feel like I said before, like I'll stare at them, like in person, if it's in person, uh, uh, public setting. I'll stare. give them looks, not stare, but like stare. they'll be looking at me, and I know that they're like, you know, checking me out. And I'll do a little, you know, a little glance, like Ooh. I see you notice me, notice me, you know, <laughs> like that type of thing. The chemistry. And they won't come, but I never did a little. Hey. <laughs> For the they, data, you have to remember that they're still human. They like to be liked. True. They like attention. Yeah. They like to know that somebody like them. Mm-hmm. You just going. <laughs> so what you looking at? Right. Do I have dirt on my face? <laughs> like, why are she looking at me like that? I mean, I look pleasant. I don't look. What's mean. the? Let me see it. Yeah, what do you, I want to see it. I mean, I can't do this. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let me see. Let me see what you got. Okay, I mean, I guess <laughs> I'd be like. 
be, I be, I be looking pussy. I be looking like this is my normal, nice self. I don't be looking That's mean or have good. like a not good. That enough. didn't tell me nothing. You just said it. My normal, pleasant self. True. You're right. You didn't give Damn. nothing extra. You give some flirty eyes. Flirty eyes. <laughs> Like a smile and be like, hey, yeah, they like to be smile. liked. Let me see the smile. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I don't be smiling. Okay, you got me there. I'll be smirking a little bit. <laughs> Let me see the smirk. Yeah. It'd be a side smirk. Okay, I'm not smiling. So you're Chester the Cat. <laughs> Garfield. I just be giving eyes, okay? It's really the damn. <laughs> they can't read that. They can't read that. You know what? You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. Once, you're right. once lockdown quarantine is over whatever we need better. to go out i want to see him. and you're gonna be my coach yeah. i need you there to be like did you see him looking at you yeah. go say hi like i you need gotta, you gotta show up no yeah i don't i do but i feel like i've never been taught that it's like, and that's never... that's that's true that's true sensuality seduction femininity are lost right now mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. it's definitely lost so I was that's my new venture. I was like, Yeah, hey, do that. I, I think I need that. Yeah. You gotta soften up. Like you can't how how the hell is somebody gonna lead you if you're not leading material? It's like the line true. leader in school. <laughs> it's only gonna be one. Very true. You have to get behind them. You Why can't you I'm, can't tell them what to do. You can't gotta be convinced. Right. <laughs> no, you're right. You're you, right. No, we need to go out somewhere public. Sure. Taylor, I want to see you. Taylor needs I, to do it on Zoom. <laughs> well, I have Zoom on my phone. Wait, do you prefer meeting someone in person or on social media? It don't matter. I don't have social media. She needs I mean, to give media, a, like, a look. A look. You know, like, I even asked my boyfriend one time, because I even asked him, like, is it okay if I do this social experiment, like, asking a guy's number? I just want to see how nervous it is. And he's like, yeah, yeah, that's sure. That's totally fine. He's okay with it. So I don't mind doing this with you. So you're not alone. Okay. <laughs> Ain't no hand holding. <laughs> yes, it is, Rita. What you gonna do? I don't know. <laughs> I'm clumsy. Say? Like okay, well then your role is my friend Taylor like you. Okay. That's your role. <laughs> and then me looking crazy. <laughs> yes, you need to be there. Like it's me. Hey, I'm Taylor. <laughs> Boop, pick me. <laughs> like no, you have you to do that. Out. You gotta be like, hi there. I do. I don't right. do that at all. You have to. Yeah, they tired of these roughnecks. We just rough. That's the problem. That we rough so and we aggressive true. and we talk I'm like this. Exactly. And we tell them we need A, B, C, D, E, and F. And if you ain't got that, period, mm-hmm. I'm not doing it. Like, we can't. That, yeah, well, who wants so somebody deep. like that? That's true. But no one doesn't. They, they, don't, they don't have instructions. <laughs> they don't have requirements. <laughs> like, it's just like, no way that? to get there. Can we step and start at step one? Exactly, step That's one. That's a really good Act point. Right. Yeah. Don't nobody want a rough girl. Oh, I feel attacked. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, yeah, I'm only saying it because I'm rough, but I'm only nice when I like you. So true. I don't <laughs> be nice either way. I don't be doing no hey. So I gotta find you. <laughs> she ain't a good point. She ain't lying. <laughs> she That's ain't lying. lying. It's a lot of people ain't gonna be. True. <laughs> Cause they're not nice. Be nice. Be, be, at least smile. Be nice. If and do some flirty eyelashes or something, or just put on some but eyelashes. Be nice. Do you find out those tolerances? That's true. True. And cut it off. Mm-hmm. Very true. Because cut it off. Yeah. <laughs> that's true. Oh, that's so true. Yeah. One time, me and my friend, we went to bar hopping. Bar hopping or nightclub hopping. Um, they'll be like I would always wear a ring. Like my boyfriend has never proposed to me or gave me a promise ring because I don't believe the promise ring. <laughs> right here. Ooh, show me. <laughs> she got. Hey. hey. <laughs> so um, I always put a ring on because like there'll be guys will coming to me. They like, do you want to dance? Do you want to drink? Like no, I'm good. I'm just having girls. And I'd be like oh that's fine. But there's some guys that are very pushy. Very pushy. So, like, I have to That's put a ring on. Like <laughs> the leadership. <laughs> the leadership. So, uh, I had to put a ring on. So, I won't forget this. My friend and here were just dancing. And there's two guys, they're friends. Two guys came up to me and wanted to dance with me. If it's not one, is the other. And I was like, my friend, she was like, two guys. The other guy didn't even look at me, nor the other guy. 
But both of them want to dance with you. I was like, oh yeah, dancing. No, 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 she wasn't. Oh. She wasn't. She was just so shocked. I'm like, what about me? <laughs> so um, this guy, he came, and then I was like, you know what? I, I appreciate you. I really appreciate you taking the lead and the confidence. I know how hard it is. I totally respect that. But I just want to let you know, I got this ring on. But um, I do have a friend. <laughs> so and she was just like, yay. <laughs> and then what happened? Huh? They were dating until she got to know him. She's like, oh no. <laughs> uh, but they got to know each other at least. That's good. Yeah. If you gave him a chance. Yeah. So. Yeah. Always give chances. Yeah. But not to no man who came to my friend first. Yeah. I was gonna say that. Yeah. I don't want nothing. Nah. Nothing. Nobody I know one. Nothing. Zero. <laughs> nothing. Mm-mm. Like nothing. Mm-mm. I don't wanna don't talk to me. <laughs> if, if you talk to her, I don't care if you picked her keys up off the floor. <laughs> Damn. <she'll> be- <laughs> don't talk to me. I don't care if you went like this to her when you was in the store <laughs> and was like, oh, you look nice today. Don't talk to me. I need like a scooby yeah. yeah, like, yeah. don't talk to me. We know what your intentions are. I totally agree with you on yeah, that. Yeah, right. I totally. Because, like, That's some of my it. friends, they will talk so much smack to the guys who I dated previously. And then they're like, oh, he's not that cute, this and that and this, blah, blah, blah. And the next thing you know, once I'm done with them, they're like, oh, hi, this and that and this. And they will go on a date with them. I'm like, what happened to you don't like them for me you think they're not um cute they're not this but yeah once we're done they're like all over them so i'm just kind of like what the freak oh yeah just sipping <laughs> just sipping they still your friends no i'm not friends with them anymore good because the girl they don't seem loyal <laughs> at all because <laughs> once i started to notice that i was like no something's wrong with you girl you're toxic. toxic yeah that is disgusting that mean, what else do you want to mind? Huh? Me? <laughs> like when you want, when you are seeking other stuff. Oh, I see. What else do you want of mine? Mm-hmm. My life, girl. Because yeah. if that's the case, we got a problem. Mm-hmm. That means, that means that's how you know these celebrities be having their life, and then their most intimate details be disclosed. That's because mm-hmm. they had an inside friend that mm-hmm. wants their life. Yeah. And then when the money came, they opened it up. Yeah, yeah. You're very true. Yeah, could be me. Hundred percent. But like I was gonna say, like, do you think it's okay when a friend dates one of your exes? No, don't talk no. to nobody. I talk. My thing is, if you're my friend, whoever not I my date, friend. No, if you're my friend, the answer's no. But if you whatever, then you, that's why you a whatever. Yeah, because okay. you're whatever. I feel like I, <laughs> I it's been frequent. Like, friends, girls don't see this. Like, if I'm dating somebody, you like him by default because I like him. Mm-hmm. When I stop liking him, y'all ain't talking to him. Y'all don't like him. He's trash. Right. <laughs> like, Am I right? Like, yeah. if I say, oh, he's this and that, yeah. like, okay, girl, da, 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 da. Yeah. And until I switch up, then y'all switch up with me. Yeah, I and agree. And then we move along with him. Yeah. him. That's how it should go. Yeah. Like, something that I have always mentioned to one of my friends when they have, like, a really brutal breakup, I would tell them, okay, just let it all out right now. But tomorrow we're going to look so bomb. We're going to go out. We're going to make him suffer and make him realize that he lost something. But And you're you're going to deserve so much better. Mm-hmm. Then that's something I do agree with you that, like, if your friend likes him, you support them. If your friend doesn't like them, you're on the same page with them. Yep. Like, that motherfucker, no. No. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. Here's the thing with that. What's up? <laughs> Educate us. To an extent. Yeah, to an extent. To an extent. Yeah, to an extent. As your friend, I'm only telling you half the story. Why? I'm only telling you the parts I want you to know. I didn't tell you his side because I'm not him. And sometimes... Oh, that's <laughs> true. You, Julia, that's why you make yeah. sense. Yeah. Cause you be thinking deep. Yeah. You be thinking deep. She looks so at all the pictures, <laughs> all angles. We're just like I can't on so one many. side. Yeah. On one so side. That's why I appreciate my friends. So we're like, all right, we all that ranting. What did you do? Like, <laughs> what you do? Let's call them up. Let's figure it out. Yeah. What did you do? That's You're true. right. That's because so if there's a hundred percent, right? It mm-hmm. takes a hundred percent effort 
even if he did 97%, that there was 2% worth, yeah. that that 3 you could have did something different. You're very true. But you chose true. not to. Mm-hmm. Now I get it. Damn, if it's social it. media, <laughs> she got jail. Yeah. <laughs> if it's social media, when I move, you move. If I'm done, done, like if I'm done, done, you need to be done, done. Mm-hmm. Get rid of them. But because there's there like my some of my friends, they're still. I'm not, they don't even talk to them on the phone or anything, but they're like they're sociable. Like and that's a, that's what I'm saying. That's another thing that comes with growing up. Like you can't just off people. That does, mm-hmm. That's not a realistic man. What you mean, off people? Like, like you can't off? just cut people off oh, anymore. Yeah. I have cut. I, you I can distance off. them. You dissociate them. You yeah. remove. People I remember we talking about in the office. Yeah, but you can't. Like, what, why are you cutting them off? Mm-hmm. Because they didn't like you. Because it didn't work. Mm-hmm. I just think like people see it as an embarrassment because like um, one of my boyfriend's be. best friend, he got dumped.